Hello and welcome back to Game Episodes. In today's episode, we've got something super special for you because we have a brand new game. It's called Tech Corp. I've been keeping my eyes on this game for a long time recently, and it finally released today, July 25th, 2019. I'm super excited to give it a go and share it with you guys, my viewers. So let's give it a start. All right, here we go. Starting up a new game. I have no idea how to play this game, by the way. Absolutely none. All right, company name. Let's call our company Game Episodes Incorporated. Pretty simple. Oh, I can't put a period. That's all right. Game Episodes Incorporated. Looks like normal mode is all we have uh, available to us. So let's go normal mode. Ooh, pick a starting region. Looks like America is the only place to start. Oh, wait, no, we could pick any place. Okay. Ooh, the options. Well, I am based in America, so I will start in the USA. Okay, I've selected the region. Now what? Do I change my interests here? Desktop, laptop, tablet, phone, consoles, and games. Oh, here we go. Confirm. Here's the demographics, the age groups. This is cool. Does it change if I click? Like, what if I click Russia? Oh, there's different markets in each country or in each, I guess, region. So what about East Europe? A lot of tablets and phones in East Europe. What about North Africa? Games. Australia. They love phones. All right, so USA really likes phones and games. And they're okay with these yellow items, I guess. The desktop, laptop, and tablet. That's cool. All right, let's start in the USA. Here we go. All right, here we go. Check it out. It's our little office. It looks like a garage. We got an open sign, a bicycle hanging off the wall. All right, here it says, Welcome to Tech Corp. Welcome. I will help you while you get your ropes managing our company. Let's start by buying our first desk. All right, that sounds good. Thank you, advisor. Let's buy a desk. How much money do I have? 40 grand. Oh, man. I, I probably don't want to spend it all on a desk. Oh, they're all the same price anyways. Ooh, a manager desk. All right, I think basic. It looks like it's trying to get me to buy the basic desk, so... I think that's what I'll get. Ooh, I can put it anywhere I want. Left mouse button to place, right mouse button to rotate, and middle mouse button to cancel. All right. Okay, cool. 90 degree rotation here. I'll probably put the desk... Yeah, right there. Nice. Now we gotta hire a worker. Okay, let's hire a worker. Employees. We don't have any. Now hire your first worker by going to the bottom menu and recruiting a sales executive. We need a sales executive. After hiring them, click on the desk to assign them a new seat. Okay, so we need to get, okay, thank you. Search for employees. Hire and assign a sales executive. Okay, employee level, low level. That sucks, we can't get better employees than low level. That's fine. Duration that they're gonna work. Oh, the, this is the duration of the search. The longer the search, the more candidates. All right, uh, list, because we're trying to start out, let's just do five days. Start recruitment. Yay! We've got candidates ready to hire. A whole bunch of them are popping up. All right, so sales executive. Let's get somebody like younger because I want our company to last a long time. So here's 22. Here's 23. They've got their stats right here. Negotiation, sales. Okay, this guy's negotiation is 40 and sales is 32. So way better than Vanessa here with 10 and 7. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's keep going down the list here. I hope that 16 candidates, geez. All right, let's just go look at negotiation and sales numbers. And age too, because I want them to be young. Here, 28 uh, with a 50 and a 44. That's probably gonna be our best bet. 28 years old, 50 and 44. They're only 30,000, nice, let's hire this person. Monica Miller, we're gonna hire her. I need a desk, okay. I thought I had a desk. If you haven't yet. Your new employee needs a workstation. Buy a desk if you haven't yet. And assign your new employee. Okay, we've done that. Assign. There we go. Okay, so you gotta click that little symbol up there to assign Monica to a desk. Alright, click on the sales executives and search for a new software contract. Software contract. All right, looking for contracts. Monica, already getting to work. She's been at work for like five minutes and she's already getting contracts for us. Open the staff recruitment page again, hire a programmer and assign him to a desk. Oh, we're gonna need another desk, looks like. 
All right, hire a programmer. Starting the recruitment. Right, let's view the candidates here. So, are they all the way down here? Programming, yeah, there they are, programmers. All right, programming, 50, 45. We want, and ooh, endurance is a factor as well. Looks like our first candidate's the best. Let's keep scrolling and see if we, here's 50 and 46. Fifty-seven endurance. Fifty forty-five. She's thirty-three. And the other Vanessa is twenty-three. Right, we're gonna hire the younger Vanessa. Because I want our company to last forever. So twenty-two years old probably has a better life expectancy. Let's hire Vanessa. I think we need to get a desk for Vanessa though. Alright, let's get a desk. Like, do we need a engineer desk or what do we need? I can only get a basic desk. Alright. We're gonna put and put Vanessa in the corner. Nobody puts baby in the corner. <laughs> All right, and then we gotta assign Vanessa. Nice. Okay, so our first software contract is now ready. Notice the card on the right sidebar. Uh, click it to get started on your first development contract. All right, let's do it. So accept the contract. I didn't even read it. No, how do I go back and read the contract? After assigning your programmer to a seat, click on him to assign him some work. I have only a female programmer. Note that the programmers can produce software components. Okay, hold on. What was our uh, software contract? Can we read it? Oh man, I wish I read that. Maybe I'll go back in the video and pause it and see what it said. All right, uh, let's see. Vanessa, we gotta click her. Tell her what components to work on, I suppose. Hmm. I don't know which one. No products to work on. We gotta work on something. All right, so the United States really likes that mobile phone and games. Um, ugh, what do we pick? Encryption, algorithm, optimization. Maybe that'd be good. Database, media, audio, camera, video. Let's just do video. Okay, working on a video component to our... Oh, it says right here what we need. That was silly. Why would I do that? Okay, so we need UI components, networking components, backend components, and encryption components. Managers are now available. Hire a manager to automate your work and break time of your employees. Managers require a manager desk. Select what kind of employee you want your managers to manage. Assign employees, choose a color tag, change the break time, and assign tasks. All right, cool. So it looks like I could do that by myself. I probably am going to have to because I only have $330 left. Uh, but once I get a little bit more money, We'll be able to assign a manager to our employees. That'll be pretty cool. All right. Can I move around here? I don't think I can. I don't think I can move around. That's okay. All right. Um. So she's doing the wrong thing. Okay. We'll stop her after five. Okay. Cool. She got some video components. Great. But we need UI components. All right. So we gotta get three, or we gotta get five UI components. Oh, look! It automatically fills up. Nice. We only have 70 days left to design our product. I was slacking. I was learning about the game. I like the look of this game. It's pretty cool. It's got our objectives down here, so we can always keep an eye on what we're supposed to be doing. It's got notifications out here. It's got this nice visual, little visual of our office. I went one too far in the UIs. So that's okay. Let's go to networking. Oh, you can pause and fast forward as well. Oh, that's kind of handy. I can fast forward. Networking is taking forever. I don't know if, how much I want to fast forward though, because we don't have very much time left. I have no fans right now, that's kind of sad. Fans, zero. <laughs> I don't have a factory. Oh, so we can get a factory. I am in debt! Oh my gosh! $10,000 in debt! This was a dumb idea. Who said start a company? I really hope our product... No, our employee's energy is too low. I keep saying him, although there's like women and men in this game. It should just say, probably just should just say they. Give them a break so they can work at full speed again. All right, we got to stop this. We got to give Vanessa a break. Vanessa, take a break. 
You need at least one decorative furniture. What? <laughs> I, there's nowhere to rest because I don't have decorative furniture. Okay, that makes perfect sense. All right, let's go get some decorative furniture. All right, let's go to the shop. Uh, is this? No. Uh, my God, I'm already $10,000 in debt and I have to buy all this decorative furniture place to rest. I think I'm gonna get this one because it says boost plus five. We'll get a couch for them to nap on. I don't have money to buy that work harder. How am I supposed to give my employee a rest so that I can make money? No, oh, I could get a loan? That's risky. All right, let's pause because we're still in fast forward mode. No, we only have 22 days left. Oh my God, I'm gonna fail. I'm gonna fail miserably in my first contract. Okay, we can't. We need to get a loan somehow. Loan. Money. How do I get more money? Finances. Get this out of here, couch. Okay. Finances. No loans available. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> we are gonna fail miserably. <laughs> this is so sad. Okay, we have to push through. Vanessa, we have to push through and build this stuff. The back-end components. We need to get them done. You got less than 22 days. Oh my god, it's like not even moving and we need three of them. Oh, duh, because I was paused. What an idiot. Pfft. All right, 22 days left. We need four backhand components. That's two. I think we'll get it. I think we'll get it. This, this product needs to make us tons of money, though. We're 20 grand in debt. Okay, we got four. All right, now we need to go to the encryption content or encryption component. Oh, yeah, she's going to get it done in 13 days. Let's go, Vanessa. This can buy us a couch and you can take a nap at work. I'm such a cool boss. Okay, completed. Pause it. Don't want to run out of time. All right, Vanessa, goodbye. Deliver the product. What? What does this say? Software contract. Okay, so we ha we can get a new software contract. Holy mackerel, I just made 43 grand. No, I made over 60 grand for that contract. Is there a way to tell, like... Yeah, check that out. Look at this. I was at minus something. I was at doing very poorly. And then I just made a ton of money all of a sudden. <laughs> Here's the last 12 months of income. Mm, losing tons of money. And then pew, just pop right back up. This is inaccurate, though. I de definitely was not in debt $700,000. But the good news is we can buy a couch. Oh, it's nice. It has a little watermark that says game pause, so you don't, like, do what I did before. It's like, why is it not going? All right, cool. Let's get us a couch. Put it right there by the bicycle, the little window. Oh, I like that. This is cool how, like, custom you can make your office look. This game has proven to be pretty good so far. Leave a comment, let me know what you think of uh, Tech Corp. As far as we are right now. Okay, so what do we need to do? We need to, let's let's rest. What's her name? Vanessa, let's give her a break. Take a nap. Okay, you're fine. You don't need to take a break, which is cool. What other employees, let's play this while she takes a little nap. What other employees can I get? Like. Okay, I can't get any, I can get a manager. Probably should get a manager. I probably should accept this contract. All right, let's pause as we look through the managers here. All right, we're gonna need a young manager. Charles is pretty young. David is pretty young. He's got a better management and better endurance. I'm gonna go with David, our first male employee. David Jones. Hire. Excellent. I need to get him a manager's desk, though. So expensive for this furniture. Why can't we get budget furniture? Alright, manager's desk can be over here on the other side of the garage. And then we can assign David to that spot. What's up, David? Okay. Are you doing okay here? Move furniture, sell furniture. Oh, I can sell the couch. <laughs> Alright, Vanessa is getting better. She's got to hurry up and get better quick because we've got a whole nother software contract to deal with. Come on! All right, that's enough. She's in the green. Let's work. Okay, we need photo components. Nice! This is pretty easy to get the hang of. 
complete two contracts. We're about to be there. Earn 100k. We, I hope we will earn 100k. So our last one got a 64,000, it looks like. Okay, we've got our photo components. Encryption components, we need six of them. Oh boy, this one, we gotta speed this one up. Oh, look at that! The video components I made earlier were not to a complete waste. We've got five out of our seven already for the next contract. So if you have, oh man, that's probably a good strategy. If you have a bunch of extra programmers, you could probably just like get them making a whole bunch of components so that they're ready to go for the next contract. I like that it rolls over, that's good. Not much to say here while we're waiting for uh, Vanessa to finish these um, encryption components. Probably will zoom forward through this because it's taking a little while. Come on now, Vanessa. Oh wait, you know what we could do while we're doing this? We could figure out what um, David is supposed to do. Select employee type. Okay, he can, he can manage the programmers because I have a feeling I'm going to get a bunch of them. What is set task? Oh, oh, okay. So he can like have he can set task for all of the programmers. All right. Um, hold on. Let's pause here for a second. And then color tag. All right. Programmers will be blue. Fine. All right. And then so this is something I, I think this is how I can as assign this to all the programmers like through the manager. But I think the manager will also like tell them when to take a break when they need a break. So send employees to rest at 0%. No, let's send them to rest at like 20%. I feel like that's a good number. Okay. So David, you're doing your job. So Vanessa's going to code until she's too tired to work anymore, it looks like. Oh, I can't pick Vanessa anymore? Is that what happens when I have David managing the programmers? I can't pick her anymore? That's a little weird. I don't know if I like that. Yeah, that's confusing a little bit. She's idle. Let's see, okay. So, all right. So I do need to assign a task to her. That, that was a waste of time. All right. Encryption. Oh, okay. So now it's going to tell you what employees are doing what tasks. I wish you could still go in and con control an individual employee so you can have like an employee, you know, one employee doing one task, another employee doing another task. That would be nice. We got 40 days left and we only need to make a few more components. It's not bad. One more encryption. And then when she gets finished with that, we'll stop the task. And then we'll start the videos. Okay, let's do some, see, that's too much, that's more clicking than I was just doing. It's probably gonna be easier when I get more employees though. All right, so we need a uh, video component. Those are pretty fast. She's gonna need to rest soon, I bet. We need one more video component and we need five more UI components. Almost there. I hope she... See, this is what I'm worried about, though, because, like, it looks like... She should be resting, though, shouldn't she? Look at how low her energy is. Okay, fine. Okay, yeah, so finally he did send her to take a nap. Look at that. What a cool boss. Take a nap, Vanessa. Oof, 25 days left, and we still have five UI components. I think we'll be fine. UI, I don't think the UI components take very long to manufacture. Okay, so this person, yeah, see this person is managed, so it's like, I can't control, like, making Vanessa go back to work. Can I... What if I set a task right now? Will they go back? Yes, okay, see, like, I can't make Vanessa get off her butt on the couch and get back to work. Like, if it's crunch time, I don't mind. She can have 70% energy, that's fine. That's one thing that I would definitely change about this so far. I would definitely change the ability to control the individual workers. Like, I want the manager to still be able to do the managing, but if I really want to micromanage, I can step in there as the CEO and uh, tell the employees exactly what to do when and when to do it. That would be nice. 
See, because, look, she's still resting. We now we only have 10 days left. Come on. You're done. Okay, now she's working. Whew. That's cutting it close. Nine days left. Eight days left. We have three components. Seven days left. It's going to be so close. Four. Six days left. Here we go. Five components. We only need one more component. I think we'll make it. Yeah, we'll definitely make it. Okay, stop task. Deliver. Check it out. We made more money. Nice. Now all we need to do is do... Well, there's a whole bunch of stuff that's coming up here. All right. Uh, cool. So it says hire a researcher and research at least six different parts. Now that you have the basics of software down, it's time to work on some hardware. Hire a researcher and assign him to research on hardware parts for a product uh, that you would like to eventually create. Okay, cool, cool. And we made a ton of money again. We have 51 grand now. So I can go ahead. I'm, I'm leaving this pause right now as I search for more workers. No, not looking for contracts. I need to look for employees. All right, we need to find a researcher. Okay, looks like low level, that's fine. Now we need to play so that the researcher can... Actually, you know what, we can do multi... We can multitask. We'll accept the contract. Leave out of that for now. Tell David to tell the workers to work on camera components. All right, and then we can view our researchers as they're working and hire them. Whoa, 28-year-old researcher with 50 research and 40 programming and 58 endurance? Yes, please, and she's only 28? Nicole Smith, you are hired. All right, we need another desk for Nicole. Uh, pff, I hope it's probably going to be an engineer desk. Hold on, let's pause. What, do I? Can I hire engineers? Is that a thing? Oh, I can. Okay, so researchers probably just use a regular desk. All right, resume. Is there a quick button for that? There might be. I just don't know it. Okay, so we need to get a desk. Basic desk. Here, you can look at this cool shelf. All right, and now we'll assign Nicole that desk. All right, now, Nicole, you need to do some research, so. Researching, nice. She's researching utility tech generation one. Oh, geez. Go away. My gosh, David, we're done making video stuff. Okay, we've got new tech discovered. This is going happening fast. All right, let me pause, catch up a little bit here. All right, we need to optimize. Optimization component. Okay, go ahead and play. Now we gotta go back to the researcher. Research six different parts, okay. All right, looks like that's all I can research right now, so that's fine. I'm just gonna keep researching that until the game is happy. Oh yeah, I've already got two, two out of six parts researched. Good, good, good. Cool, I like how it keeps popping up my notifications, so it keeps me in the loop. Geez, these optimization components are taking ages. We only got one of them done. It's a long uh, amount of time that we have to. We might want to... Oh, David took a break. Does that mean Vanessa's going to take a break? No. Okay. Monica doesn't get tired. What else can Monica do? She's still just looking for contracts. All right, cool, whatever. Nicole's getting tired because she's researching a ton. David's getting tired because he's managing Vanessa, and Vanessa gets tired easy. Uh, let's get another programmer. Yeah, let's get another programmer. While they search for programmers, I will search for desks. Okay, you can take a break on the research, because we've got enough research done. You can actually take a full-on break. We'll get another desk for the programmer. Second programmer. All right, let's go take a look at our hires. Pause it so they don't lose interest in the job opportunity. Researcher, researcher, okay, programmers, 50. We want 50s into programming and then like high endurance and high research. So like this is really good. Margaret Garcia is pretty good. I feel like we need another boy in the office. Just saying, we've got a lot of women in the office. Only one boy. Let's get another guy. Let's get Thomas. I don't know if that's like <laughs> an appropriate thing to do as a boss, like looking over a candidate <laughs> for their gender. I think that's totally bad, but whatever. <laughs> it's a video game. 
All right, so let's uh, assign Thomas this desk, and then David, you will manage Thomas as well. Yeah, check that out. Nice, they're both working now. All right, now we need to go back to, okay, so we've got two optimization components out of five. Oh, do they go slow or what? Oh, it's paused, huh? <laughs> of course. All right, let's fast forward a little bit. Those take forever, and we've got two people working on it? They take forever. Good thing we hired another programmer. What is our research gonna get us? Let's finish this contract, figure out what the research gets us, and then let's call it an episode. Okay, stop the optimization. Now we need to do UI. Where is UI? Here it is. Yeah, UI goes pretty quick. And then we need media component after that. And then let's let's see. Do we get something cool from the research? You, I guess you can keep researching, that's fine. Alright, we've got enough of those. We need media components. It's okay, like I said before, it's okay to roll over, I guess, with these. I gotta close out all of these notifications here. It's a good thing to actually build up more components because they roll over to the next next task, which is pretty cool. I'm glad that they do that. Really, really glad that they do, they do that. All right, one more. Boom, stop task, deliver, make that money. Click on the first button of the menu below to begin prototyping. Ooh, okay, so it looks like our research is gonna allow us to begin prototyping. And that is all thanks to Nicole for doing all that research. Here's prototyping. Looks like a whole bunch of options here. We're gonna explore that in the next episode of Tech Corp with Gamisodes Incorporated. I hope you liked the game. Let me know in the comments if you did. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. It helps me out a lot. And leave a comment. Let me know what you think of Tech Corp and maybe send some ideas for products that we can design here in Tech Corp for Gamisodes Incorporated. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next one.